Today, we're delving into the past to examine the historical significance of December 29th. So grab a seat and come along with me as we explore the tales that actually make this day extraordinary. In Canterbury Cathedral in 1170, supporters of King Henry II killed Thomas Becket, the Archbishop of Canterbury. The Battle of Savannah in 1778 ends in failure for the British Empire's first effort to see Savannah, Georgia, the center of the American Revolution. As the 28th state to join the Union, Texas is admitted in 1845. At the Wounded Knee Massacre in South Dakota in 1890, the U.S. Army kills around 200 Lakota Sioux adults, children, and women. The Republic of China elects Sun Yat-sen as its first president in 1911. A new state called Ireland is established in 1937 as a result of the new Irish constitution. The Irish Free State is superseded. The Florida Everglades are hit by an aircraft carrying Eastern Airlines Flight 401 in 1972, killing 101 people. A 36-year civil war is ended in 1996 when Guatemala and the leaders of the Guatemala National Revolutionary Unity sign a peace agreement. Permanent normal trade ties with the United States are given to the People's Republic of China in 2001.